Mon okay. Monkey, monkey Seppuru. Seppuru, half? Half. Half, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. So, uh, can we get some of these as well? Do a... Do it? Do a, yeah, do a. Just drink and then feel like better. Oh, instant. Good, huh? Mmm. No regret, huh? I thought it might be, um... I thought it might be a little bitter or something, but it's not. Time to start this. All right, this is a bit of a, a, a throwback because uh, we're actually in Ipoh at the moment, but I just wanted to discuss our little trip to Malacca. It's not our first time in Malacca. We've actually spent a bit of time in Malacca before, so we did a lot of the temples and the kind of general touristy stuff. This time around was a little bit different, our trip to Malacca. Um, but the day was massively, massively disjointed. But saying that, we had an amazing, amazing time. Some of the first things we had that day, we went and got went to a popular place, turned out it was sold out. It was a really, really cool joint that's always basically sold out. You got to book in advance. Sold out, huh? How many pieces? One? One? Two. one yeah, one or two, yeah, do a makasi. Ah, Tini Makasi. Thank you. And um, unfortunately they, they it's made with pork lard, so we couldn't have it. We went up the road and we had some kind of pastries filled with um bean sprouts, some kind of like curry puff bean sprout with chili. Um, we want to uh, we want to try some of the um, one of our friends said to come here. He said the food's really good. He said um, he said you do some kind of bean sprouts, curry puff or something. Yeah, yeah. sprout, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Get tampa, tampa, tampa. I am dagging ikan tampa. Yeah, veggie, veggie yeah, only, veggie. veggie. Yeah, yeah, veggie. 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 Sayaran saja, yeah. This. This. Uh, Dried brown. Dried brown. Yeah. Dry prawn. Dried prawn. Can we not? Do you know what? Tidak, yeah. So I Tampa. make a new for you. <laughs> yes. Without this. Yes. Yeah. Curry puff, huh? Or uh, not? Like this, lah. Yeah. The, oh, that's that, is like it? This, uh, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That sounds yeah, good, yeah. yeah. Just like okay, this, okay. Uh, I make it for you. Okay, uh, yeah. Ah, uh, yes. Any uh, potato? Potato? Ah, uh, uh, can we get some of these as well? Do a? Do a? Do a? Yeah, do a. Thank you so much. Look at that. What we do? Oh. Mm. It's like deep fried, deep fried pastry with bean sprouts in it, essentially. <laughs> uh, Great description. That's what it is with chili sauce, it's nice, it's really good. And then we walked down from there and we got um, some UTL, some fried Chinese bread, um, made in like a kind of factory. I don't know how much of that I captured, but um, there was a couple of different things. There's the UTL and um, they were making some other fried goods as well. And that, uh, here we go. So this is a deep fried rolled bread. You see them rolling them out really long. They get really long, these things. They've got a little texture to them. It's slightly salted, it's like fried bread. Mmm, mmm. Mmm. Mm. Nice. Really nice, my mum would like it. And we also got the Pura Peering as well, the Putu Peering, which is a famous um, dessert from... Is it from Malacca? Yes, from Malacca. Proper operation in here. But we're knocking them out. Whew. So what it is, is it's supposed to be like a kueh, but it's supposed to be like a rice flour filled with gula malacca. I was like, I said, do you reckon make a thousand? He was like, I think he, his answer was easily. Yeah. Let's give this guy, let's give us a proper one. Mmm. Reminds me a lot of a soft biscuit with a kind of gooey centre. You get the coconut, you get the rice flour and you get the gula malacca. A lot of places like this, only open two hours a day, three hours a day. Very popular by people driving by and clearly a local favourite because they're only open for a few hours of the day and there were just people driving up and just picking up their picking up their orders people were just picking up boxes of them we also went to this amazing amazing cafe called the woods it might be the woods um but it was this kind of cafe with, that julia found and it was vintage in uh, second hand books kind of cafe and shop so you can buy also second hand books and stuff and they do nice meals uh, we saw them cooking, they looked really good. We only had the tea. Very nice tea though. I, yeah, I, I, I tell you what, it was really cool in there. Then we went back into um, Malacca. 
And we actually went to a place we tried to go the day before, which is this really, really famous bar with the locals that has been serving rice wine for over a hundred years. See me up here. Hello, Salamat Paggy, how you doing? Yeah. Oosh. Hello. We read about this place. This place is very famous. Very famous. You're very famous. Yes, I know. The kennel. Yeah, 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 we know, yeah, yeah. You want to have a drink? Uh, yeah, we want to try something, yeah. Sit down, yeah. amazing. Yeah. A friend we, of ours sent us. Morning, yeah, huh? a friend of ours suggested it. Yeah, a local mm. here. He said this. Uh, no, I recommend you uh, with uh, mm. the rice wine. The rice wine, this yeah. This one is Malacca one. Uh. Mm. They have a flavor, no? They have a coffee flavor. Mm -hmm. uh, pandan flavor. Mm -hmm. mm. 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 It's all flavored, no? This one is original. This one, no? Uh. And then, wait, I think. You've got more. <laughs> this is the best seller, right? Ah, this two, this like one. Rose. Wow. And what color? Like What's the most traditional one? What's the original? This one? Uh, traditional. Yeah, this traditional, one this one, one, yeah. This one also traditional one. This one 53. Original rice wine. Oh, original Malacca rice wine. One. This one, Malacca. Is that yes, that's, that's a good shout. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. Oh, there's also the lychee. Ah, this one, lychee. This one, this one yeah. rose flavored. The the percentage are twenty-seven. Mm, okay. This one high. This one forty. What's, do what do you recommend? What's your favorite? <laughs> <laughs> My favorite are uh, lychee. I like this one. Right, okay. the lychee. Drink, just a little, little bit. Little bit, huh? Not much. You don't drink much? <laughs> Not anymore, no. <laughs> I think I've got a go for the lychee one. Lychee, yeah? Oh, you want the pandan? Pandan, this one not bad. Ah, this one pandan. You know right. pandan? Yeah, we know pandan, yeah. Right, we like you want to try the lychee one? Yeah. You want the lychee, yeah? Lychee, yeah. yeah. Okay. And lychee and, and pandan. Uh, lychee and pandan, yeah. 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 So how old is this bar? Is it 100 years old? Is it yeah, this bar? Yeah. They call it the 100 year old bar. Yeah, yeah. It must be generation. 100, really? Fourth generation yeah, now? My wow. father, father in law, father. Really? Great grandfather. Wow. And has this street changed a lot? Yes. This, really? Mm, yeah. You've not, you've never decided to sell it and, you know, what move this place? Ah. You never decided to sell and, and, no. Easier life elsewhere, and you yeah. know, you know? <laughs> Forever. Forever. Uh, who's one like you? Wow, like this is very nice, yeah. And uh, for pandan. Pandan huh? as well. Yeah, yes, I see, thank you. Smell it. Mm. You want on the rock, you want a bit cold, like that, not so cold. This is okay for me, is I okay, think. Huh? This is fine, this is okay. 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 Mm. This is pandan, this one. Um, that's pandan, yeah. Mm. The it's a slightly smoky flavour. It does, that one as well though. Mm, do you think? Let me try it. Mm. You want to buy takeaway also can? Oh really? Uh, yeah. Oh that's... Very nice, no coffee? Mm. Uh, the small bottle. This one, coffee also have a small bottle. Oh nice, okay. <laughs> So there's a real selection of different treats in there. A lot of different rice wines. Got lychee, got pandan, um, all sorts of different things. Mmm, mmm. Yeah, why is it expensive? This one's expensive. You meet your wife in, in Sabah or...? Uh, no, no, I married the... Uh, married here? Yeah, Malaysian yeah. girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. Wow, well, we were taking picture. Taking a little picture, oh, really. Yeah. Yeah. Here? Let's see him, yeah, he's nice. Look, he's mental in this place. Yeah, yeah. One, one more? No. I might try another one, one more. Give one more minute and I'll, I'll yeah. think. Okay, so I pick here, so I pick here. So I can pick here, I would think. <laughs> yeah. You guys are doing this? What's that? Yes, you drank this? Yeah. Wow. 
No, not all of it. Not all of it. No, no, we did drink all. We only had one glass so far. So that guy that we met just then, he was from Sabah, and he's a Christian from Sabah. But he says he's got a Malaysian wife, or Malay wife, and uh, she doesn't let him drink. Or she doesn't appreciate him drinking alcohol. She can't drink, and she's not happy when he drinks. So he's not allowed to bring the bottle home. He'll, he'll come out for a drink. That's it. And uh, it was an old firm favourite of sailors that used to go into the area. So we kind of sat down with her for a couple of drinks. But um, amazing, amazing to meet this woman. This woman is, is this bar has been passed down from generations, you see. And um, she is her husband. I understand recently passed so she's now leading the bar by herself and her son is helping her um, but she's there every day nine o'clock nine thirty till till four the bar's got busier what is it Saturday morning here and uh, so apparently this is only recently got really traditionally quite famous it was a very traditional thing and it's recently been frequented more and more tourists and, and whatnot but yeah, but um, we're speaking to some locals here who, who mentioned that they've been coming here for years. Is it? She gave us really nice rice krispies. Monkey, monkey, separu, separu, half, half, half. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Terima kasih. Thank you. Mm. Can you get the coffee flavour. Oh, this one's very good. This one's the best one. If you're at this bar, you need to try the coffee one. It's now 12:30, and uh, there's more people in the bar, making more friends. Um, it's good vibes. The group here have been coming here for, 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 for years. Um, I think I mentioned that earlier, actually. The family, yeah. And uh, they speak all sorts of different languages, is how they were mentioning. They speak Hokkien together, they speak Chinese, they also speak English together. It's a real mixture of different languages being spoken. It's pretty impressive. Malaysia is so impressive like that. It's always very diverse. And um, what have I got? Very diverse, and, and people can speak so many different languages here. That's why that's why you got to date someone who, who speaks multiple languages. Because when you have kids, that these kids will be able to speak more languages than. Uh, and this one uh, is herbal. Herbal, ah, herbal, herbal. ah, herbal. yes. yes. Oh. Daddy, Daddy China. Ah, yes, yeah. yes. 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 Yeah. If you're in Malacca and uh, you fancy a drink, a hard drink, you know, go sit down there. You'll end up chatting to the lady and you might even make some friends in there like we did. Anything else happened in Malacca? We had uh, some very good herbal teas. Being fair, Mmm. Afterwards, we went and we went and we went to get some Taufel Fa. Then we went to a herbal um, tea place we found on the way. We were walking through and we kind of saw this place and we we're like, let's start for tea. And we started speaking to the lady and she started telling us all about Chinese medicine. She said, Have you ever had any Chinese medicine? So we said, No. I mean, to Western, I can't lie to you, Western, Chinese medicine is all a bit like, I don't trust it. Like, I don't know if it's an East, Western and Eastern thing, but. You know, you hear about this thing like um, the famous one, the bear, bear bile, you know, black bear bile or something like that. I've heard all these things. And I always think it's just a load of nonsense. You hear about shark fin soup as well. Chinese medicines and Chinese beliefs, they're very different to the ones we have in the West. So you always kind of have these assumptions that maybe it's all a bit superstitious. Thank you. Right. Uh, this is a bit bitter. Right. It's very good also. You got a very bad uh, sore throat. Oh really? So just just drink and then feel like better. Oh, instant. <laughs> so this is, is it helping? Uh, you feel better? Yeah. <laughs> you try some uh, Chinese Chinese uh, medicine before? 
No, never really. No, you first time. Try some cool. Really? Want to try some chill, chill things? What's the best one? What, what should I try? What? Uh, herbal no, jelly. Herbal jelly. Really? Yes. Herbal okay. jelly. Should we you try that? Jelly? Yeah, yeah. Let's have the herbal jelly. Yeah. Mm. I thought it might be um I thought it might be a little bitter or something, but it's not, it's very nice. It's honestly really, really good. Really good. No no, it's perfect. This needs to be recommended to everyone this. This is huge. This is the first time I tried this, it's really good. Yeah, yeah. The good we, we less sugar, we don't take much sugar. Ah. If they say you don't believe, you can take uh, a is bit. Is it sweet, it, is it? Yeah, what it's slowly it? chewy, but it's a little bit sweet. What is okay. it? Come on, you just put inside and chew. Mm. Isn't it? You can even swallow. Okay. This is to the top and then mm. it's sweeten. Mm. You sweeten the herbal tea. Even the herbal mm. jelly also you add in. And then this one is also egg in. What plant is it? This is, actually, it's not a plant. This one in English, the, the name I couldn't give you. I'm not very sure. I don't know if I one day I fire, I will let you know. <laughs> Can't tell. Them. Oh, you, you don't um, yeah. You don't know, you know. Uh, Rose and uh, and the Chinese medicine. Yeah. They got a lot of difficult name with yeah. it. So it, it, lot, we we even people don't people know the English them. name yeah. also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. also I don't know it got English name or, uh, or not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But saying that, you know, we we did try it and it was. It was nice, like we had, we had like a herbal tea that was super, super bitter. Julia was like, like a little bit bitter, and Julia was like, yeah, fine. I think it got bitter the next day, we didn't finish it all. But it wasn't right when we had it. It was so bitter. It was, it was um, yeah, it was the one to, to refresh you from the heat, make your body temperature go down a bit. Great, so that was our trip to Malacca. If I think of anything else, I'll add it, but um, yeah, nice one, and uh, I think that's it from us, isn't it? That's it from us. That is it from us on Malacca.